Hey everyone, in this video we'll be using the Triceracorus for a variety of modulation effects. Triceracorus is not only capable of wide stereo chorus, but can also be used for vibrato, flange, detune, and even subtle reverb. Let's start by dialing in a tri-chorus. Adding in the left and right voices will spread the modulation across the stereo field, resulting in a wider chorus. To make the chorus even more lush, let's introduce some detune and delay. Delay is a secondary parameter and is accessed by the Alt button. Now let's dial in a vibrato sound. Setting the mix knob at noon is how we use Triceracorus as a vibrato. Let's slow down the rate and use the filter to achieve a more lo-fi vibrato. Now I'll set the filter back to noon and increase the depth and rate for a more intense vibrato. Now let's check out a flange setting. I'm starting with a pretty standard chorus setting that uses all three voices and detune. Now I'll increase the mix of the detune and introduce a very short delay time to get closer to that swooshy flange sound. Let's check out Triceracorus's detune. Here I have the pedal engaged, but all parameters at either zero or noon. This is how we can use the detune without having any chorus happening. Detune controls the mix of the stereo detune. The pitch of the detune can be adjusted as a secondary parameter. Now let's go for a short reverb sound. I'm using the chorale voices and currently have zero delay. Mm -hmm. 
Now let's add in the delay. When using the corral voices, the delay time for each voice is slightly different, which helps to smooth out what sounds like a reverb tail. Triceracorus is capable of much more than chorus, and its onboard presets can be used to conveniently switch between a wide variety of modulation types. To learn more, be sure to check out eventideaudio.com.